all right welcome to all Life mass tv my name is jake's animal and here we have a challenge on the board question reads y plus one all over y equal to three then what will now be the value of y to the power of two minus one plus one all over y squared okay before going to today's challenge if you are new to this channel kindly subscribe and turn on the bell notification button so that you get notified whenever we drop our video because yeah we try our little best to drop a new videos every day now let's go to today's challenge all right we pull down our question by taking a solution solution let's pull down the main equation which is dx we'll deal with dx which is y plus one all over y equal to three now, the first thing we're going to do here is to square both sides of the equation. Okay, so we're going to square this together and square the uh, right-hand side. And so we're going to have this to be y plus 1 all over y r squared equal to 3 squared. Now, I'm going to use uh, the binomial expansion method to expand this. So if I go by using the binomial expansion, we're going to have this to be uh, y squared, okay, plus... 2 dot y dot 1 all over y okay then plus 1 all over y r squared equal to 9 good now if you look at this carefully automatically dx we go with dx and so here we are now left with uh, y squared plus 2 plus 1 all over uh, y squared okay equal to now, now, what I just uh, applied here is the law of indices which says that if you have um, A all over B all to the power of M, this is the same thing as A to the power of M all over B to the power of M. If you apply that here, the square of 1 is 1 and the square of Y remains Y square. Okay, this now gives us this. Now, if you look at this carefully, so from here now, now that we have a uh, big part is here, we have one all over y to the power of two is also here. We are having minus one here, but here we are having a plus two. So what we do here is to, you know, subtract three from both sides of the equation. Okay. So from here, let's say subtract, subtract three from both sides. Okay. If you do that, we're going to have this to be y squared plus 2 minus 3 plus 1 all over y squared equal to 9 minus 3. Whatever we do to the right hand side, we must do to the uh, same to the left hand side. And so we we'll end up having y squared minus 1 plus 1 all over y squared equal to 6. Okay, now if you look at this expression here you now, it's exactly what we have here you now. What is the value equivalent to here? X what? Six. So dx is our answer to uh, this simple challenge. As simple as A, B, C. Okay. So our y square minus 1 plus 1 all of our y square equal to what? 6. Simple. If you learn something from these short videos, give the video a thumbs up. Okay. If you like what is going on here. Okay. Do not forget to share with family and friend members who need this knowledge. Okay. Remember. My name is Jigs and he loves you so much because you are all already there and always there. And all of us at Lymas TV love you so much. Bye for now.